topik 6 polynomial 6.3 partial fraction. Example 10. Express this improper fraction as partial fraction. Okay, since it is improper fraction, so we must use long division first. This fraction we already done in example 5. And this is our long division. Okay, after we do long division, we write the answer. So the answer is We take the quotient and then the remainder divide by the divisor and the divisor we take in the linear form. Then we take this fraction to do Partial fraction. We have two linear factor, so we decompose into two fraction. The first one is divided by x plus three. The second fraction is over x minus two. The numerator is constant, so we put A here and B here. Then we equalize the denominator and at the same time, we eliminate the denominator. So, 7x minus 8 equal to A times, so this fraction will multiply with x minus 2. And then for B, it multiply with X plus 3. So here we use value of X is 2 and another value of X is negative 3. Substitute X equal to 2 at both sides. So, 2 into the left hand side, 7 times 2, you get 14 minus 8 equal to 2 minus 2 becomes 0 plus 2 substitute in this x. So, 2 plus 3 is 5. So, we get 5b. So, 14 minus 8, 14 minus 8 is 6, equal to 5B. So, B, we get 6 over 5. And if we substitute X equal to negative 3, we get negative 21 minus 8 equal to negative 3 substitute into x so we get negative 5a plus 0 so here we get negative 29 equal to negative 5a a equal to 29 over 5 then the value of a and b we substitute into our partial fraction so it become x minus 1 29 over 5 over x plus 3 and then plus 6 over 5 x minus 2 then we simplify this fraction into the simplest form So, it becomes 29 over 5 times x plus 3. And another one, 
6 over 5 times x minus 2. In sample 11, express this fraction. Example 11, express this improper fraction as partial fraction. This improper fraction must use long division. So the divisor, we must expand. So we get 4x squared plus 4x plus 1. Using long division, then we put numerator. Four x cube over four x square, we get x. Then we multiply. Then we subtract. Twelve minus four, we get eight. Thirteen minus one, positive twelve x and seven. We bring down. 8x square divide 4x square we get positive 2 and then multiply with the divisor 8x square 8x plus 2 12 minus 8 4x 7 minus 2 5 the answer of Long division Then we take the quotient x plus 2 plus remainder 4x plus 5 divided by divisor the divisor we take in the linear factor form that is 2x plus 1 square then this fraction we do the partial fraction and first we decompose that fraction into two proper fraction that is a over 2x plus 1 square b over 2x plus 1 so we equalize the denominator and also eliminate so we get 4x plus 5 equal to this fraction the denominator is already equal with the left so it does not need to multiply with any linear factor. For another fraction, B multiply with 2x plus 1. So we substitute the value of x that is equal negative 1 over 2. So this value comes from the linear factor 2x plus 1. We substitute at both sides. And then we simplify 4 times negative 1 over 2, we get 2. And the left, we total up, we get 3. So A equal to 3. Another value of X, we can choose X equal to 0. So at left, we get 5 equal to the value of A, we Substitute the value of A, that is 3. And plus, and plus B times 0 plus 1. So the value of B is 2. Then we substitute the value of A and B into partial fraction. So the answer is X plus 2 plus 3 over 2x plus 1 square plus 2 2 over 2x plus 1.